What is up you guys and welcome back to another video. So this is the beginning of a new series. I know I've got like three different series going on. I've got top five fits, I've got my personal opinion on brands and now I've got how to style X, how to style this color or that color. First episode we're doing is on orange. So how to style orange, outfits I really like, what I don't like about it and so on. I don't really have a lot of orange stuff. I've got this jacket, which isn't even orange. It's like a reversible jacket. I always wear it like this because, to be honest, I am not a massive fan of orange. And the reason why is because it's kind of hard to style. What you're gonna do is replace the grapefruit from your mouth. You're gonna twist up and down on his shaft and suck the head at the same time. <laughs> And I think it's really hard to get it like right. So I've only got like three orange items. This jacket, the Ricardo Tishi and Nike shoes. Just a bit of orange detailing. And these fucking horrible orange pillows. The reason why I went for orange first is because it's like a color which has been really in like the last half year. So you had Vedemong or Vedmong making the really, really long sleeve ones stuff like misbehave supreme north face made their collaboration recently there was the v loan pop-up or v loan however you fuck you want to say it i don't know what asap bar is thinking v loan whatever but it's been a color which has been kind of in the last half year it's also one of the really hard colors to style because for me with orange it's really really easy to get too much of it like it might be too orange or too bright or you have orange with the wrong colors so yeah that's why we are doing orange first so i think in the fit where orange really excels and looks the best in my opinion is when it's just like a single item or it's like one standout item or if it's just small details so in this guy's fit he's wearing the orange jumper and it's kind of a statement piece which kind of breaks the whole thing it works really nice with the black and the kind of grayish white trousers and it kind of makes his outfit pop more than it would if he hadn't had it same goes for Ilya. i think her name's Ilya. again it's like the color which makes it pop it goes really nicely with the lighter colors and it really is that statement color it seems like the color scheme which orange really excels in is gray white dark blue light blue and did i say black 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 because that's where there's like a good contrast without it being like screaming it is very simple colors and it kind of allows orange to really really pop same thing goes here with the v loan tote bag it's just nice simple something orange to put in it's not screaming it it's not making it into an orange outfit but it still looks really good and it's that nice little contrast it's also important to remember there are different kinds of orange so there's that really really light orange and there's a really really dark orange and you've got the one in the middle which is one they used on the Supreme and the North Face and the V-Loan shoes, where it's more of like a hyper orange. And it seems like hyper orange goes a lot better with black, whereas something like a lighter orange, like this one, goes really, really well with the gray. I think a problem with a color like orange is if you have two different types of orange or two different tones, it might look really weird. So that's why if I had to wear these shoes with this kind of orange and I put it together with the North Face and Supreme Orange, it might look really, really shit. That's one thing to have in mind. So moving on to kind of more like the block color or like the solid orange fits. Ross is wearing a Craig Green jacket. It is a very bright orange. It really, really takes a man to pull it off. Man or construction worker. No, but Ross is wearing the Craig Green jacket and I think it's really nice. It's kind of good work wear vibe. He kept it very simple with the black trousers and I think that's the way for it. You can't really just mix orange with anything. You have to keep it very simple. Otherwise it gets very, very confusing and it doesn't really look that great. Again here, Leia, I really, really like this. It's nice, it's summery. Again, it's the whole block color thing and the colors go really well. There's orange and a dark blue, orange and denim jeans, like the light vibe. You know you're doing it right when you're matching your fucking trousers to your dog. That's like dedication, that's fashion dedication. This guy wearing a pair of car pants, some sauce in his shoes. I like that he matched the jacket with the shoes. And like, that's the kind of work where orange vibe, which I really like. Here we've got Jar Eel. 
this is the lighter orange I was talking about, where it almost borderlines to yellow. And I think this goes really well with the dark jeans or a pair of lighter jeans. Again, keeping it very simple. I did ask this guy and he does indeed skate. So he is allowed to wear that hoodie. Don't worry guys. You don't have to flame him in the comments. So just to like summarize the whole thing, I think orange is a great color. You just have to style it right. Or I don't know what that was. Orange is a great color, you just have to style it right. Also, when dealing with orange, I would always go for a bit more of a baggy look because if you go for like a really slim look, or like a slim orange t-shirt, I think it's gonna look really, really restrained and you're gonna look more like an orange than some fashionista who just watched a Magnus running video. Yeah, my, like my go-to or my key when of orange is just to keep it minimal, keep it very simple, don't necessarily go overboard with a lot of different colors. Orange is a very, very statement color and it has to be kept that way. So I wouldn't go out and mix orange with pink with light blue because it just doesn't synergize very well. If I wear orange, as I said, I always wear it like small details. I wear this jacket and with these shoes and it kind of matches. It's not over the top, it's more low key. Keep it black. Keep it simple. Orange is the new black. Actually a pretty fucking bad series, but... Yeah, I don't know what else to say. This is like the first episode in the series. So I'm gonna improve from here. But I want you guys to let me know what you think. Do you think this is something you wanna see again? Or is it a bit shit? I probably made it a bit more shit than it should have been, but anyhow. Anyhow, anyhow, anyhow. Thank you very much for watching. And I will... See you in a couple days. This is harder than it looks like actually. So yeah, on a scale from like 1 to 10, I'd say orange gets... Or orange gets a... Um, a 6 out of 10. 7 out 6 out of 10. I don't really like orange. I respect people who can put it off, but I don't really feel like it's my thing, so. So.